They were still together when they when we moved to England. My father was still in America. He came over to visit. And my mom said to me a couple days before he comes, your dad's coming, we're gonna go get a haircut. And I was must have been about 12 or something. Went to get a haircut, we went to our normal hairdresser, hairdresser wasn't there, got some other hairdresser, cut my hair, whatever, whatever. And when we got back to the house, my mom's like, I don't like how she cut your hair, she cut your hair wrong, she cut your hair wrong. And I'm only 12, right? So I'm like, yeah, she cut my hair wrong, she cut my hair wrong. So when my dad came, my dad turns off, he's only there for a couple hours, I haven't seen him in nearly six months. I said, oh, and my mom said, I hate the way they cut his hair. And my dad, and I, and I said, yeah, they cut my hair wrong. Today. And my dad lost his temper. He said, what the fuck are you doing? You raised my sons to bitches. What the fuck are my haircuts? I leave you here with my boys. You're talking about, you tell them to worry about their haircuts? They're fucking men, who cares about that? Their haircut doesn't matter. When they grow to men, no one's gonna care what their hair looks like. Their haircuts are stupid. And my mom's like, well, no, Emery, it's just, she cut it wrong, da, da, da. And my dad was like, listen, I, I trust you with my boys and you fucking cut the hair on. So they got some big art. So I'd only seen my dad for three hours at this point, fucking six months. They got a big argument, my mom kicked him out of the house. So he left the house, right? So he went to the hotel. And then um, the next day he called me, he goes, I can't come to the house, your mom doesn't want me there, come to me. And I came to him and we went to the hairdresser and I was only 12, so this is a traumatic experience, right? I cried my eyes out. I don't know why I cried, but I was upset. He goes, come with me, boy, boy. He goes, you learn when you're older, you're gonna understand when you're older. You're gonna shave your head. 